waiting for. It's time to get some food in our bellies. Mm -mm. Uh, what are you going to make for us, Nathan, the king of the air fryer? I'm back again. Um, yes, we are making spicy empanadas, yeah. but a healthier version. We're not using puff pastry. We're using tortilla, tortilla nice. wraps, okay. um, which obviously is lower in calories. Um, and then we're going to have garlic butter potatoes to go with that salad and crunchy pita chips. It have, looks which, sensational, which, all of it yeah, there. Looks got a guac on the side. Yeah, just light and refreshing. Mm -hmm. So here we have, um, this is for the empanada. So 200 grams of cooked chicken. Mm -hmm. um, so if you have any leftover chicken, oh, yeah. just, it just works perfectly. Bit of chorizo, um, so just throw it all in. So we have a bit chicken of... Chicken and chorizo together is like... It's just a marge. Team, isn't it? It's yeah. a match made in heaven. Um, so that's a bit of sriracha. So I know not everybody likes a bit of spice, but I, I do. Um, just to give it a bit of a kick. Some paprika, some, some jalapeno. Um, mm. And you can be creative as well. You can use whatever you want. Thanks. Anything you have left over in the house. Bit of veg, you can even do veggie um, empanadas as well. So peppers, jalapenos, and a bit of cheese. Um, obviously, mel cheese melting on the inside is just what you I'm want. I'm just gonna try this as you're talking. Okay, you do that. If I go yeah. quiet, you know why. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Mm. So oh, wow. give that a mix together. So that's your yeah. filling. Oh, yeah. yeah, so mix that all together. And this stretches quite far as well. You'll probably be able to make about seven or eight of the okay. mini tortillas, where obviously you can use the larger wraps as right. well if you are. I feel like the kids would one. love these. Mm. So like rather than a sandwich or something. Just like that, just um, maybe about a heap tablespoon, probably. Mm -hmm. um, okay. So in you go. And then just a the beaten egg just to seal it, um, just around the sides. So, and then close it over. And do you have an air fryer? Because I know, Rochelle, you have one the last time I was yeah. on. You yeah. You have one. Andy, do you have one? I don't air? have one. Of them. You don't? No. no. I don't. I'm telling you, I thought that was quite a new thing. Yeah. I haven't got the space for it. The footprint's They're quite big. big, yeah. And that's the double one. Yeah, yeah. the double one. Now, you, now you're just you, showing off. Yeah. You can get the single one, though, that's, yeah. that, that's half the size. Yeah. Um, and also, I eat so much unhealthy food. Why I, is it? <laughs> yeah. To me I, well, it? I feel like it's become like the new barbecue for my husband. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, it's like the indoor barbecue. It, it feels like it's his thing that he's really. Let excited me make something about. in oh, the air fryer. Yeah. Put it in the air fryer. Hello, it's me, Marvin. Let <laughs> yeah. me make something in the air <laughs> yeah. I don't know where he's driving to, but yeah. <laughs> It's in the air fryer. So, <laughs> here we go, into the air fryer. So we have, um, you can do three or four, you can do it in two drawers. Um, and in they go for nine, 10 minutes um, at 200 and that is it. Well, obviously you need to turn it on. Um, and See, that noise is yeah. so familiar yeah. to me now. I'm like <laughs> triggered. What? What's he putting in it now? What's he making yeah. in the air fryer? Oh, he's driving to the air fryer again. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, and that's it. Yep. Uh, they come out. Obviously, you can have it with a salad, whatever Lovely. you want. And you and could literally put whatever you want in there. You can make you? them veggie. You can do like you can use corn mince. You know the okay, yeah. Because um, minces, you can use beef in them as well, which I yep. quite like okay. as well. Um, so and you are, they're a lot healthier than having a pastry. They feel clean, Obviously, they yeah, feel light. Yeah, yeah, because you would normally put puff pastry in it and you could deep fat fry it as well. Yep, of course. Um, yeah. But obviously we're not doing that. No. No. We're, we're going on holiday soon, yeah. so we're having the, <laughs> the healthier version. Mm -hmm. So on to the potatoes on the side. So this is garlic butter potatoes with mm -hmm. a bit of Parmesan. Yeah. You, you don't need to uh, parboil them. You literally just chop them. Um, so they haven't oh, been really? parboiled. Nothing at all. So um, obviously a bit of oil spray. Um, just pop a bit of oil spray on. You can use like the one calorie one, but I think obviously mm -hmm. olive okay. oil is um, better. A bit of paprika and a bit of salt and pepper. And then that's it, end of the year. So I'm surprised you don't have to parboil them. I know. Yeah. Yeah. So if I was making chips in it, I would uh, put the chips in a microwavable bowl with a couple of tablespoons of water for seven minutes mm -hmm. and that's parboil them. And then you can just chuck them straight into, oh, wow. straight okay. into the air fryer. So. That's that's them pretty much yep. ready to go. Um, and into the air fryer. It's just the, the ease of it all is... It's so easy. So I'll put these in for 20 minutes at 200, but I'll shake halfway just to kind of... as if, if Obviously, if you were deep fat frying, sort of then it just to like give it yeah. a bit of a shake. And Does Marvin make sure he gets it? When he's gone to the air fryer, <laughs> does he make sure he then does he? Oh, to be honest, all he seems to put in the air fryer are chicken thighs. Oh, oh I've made some chicken though. thighs, and I don't eat chicken thighs. Yeah. And he puts like twelve of them in at once. Bring some wrapped yeah. in foil. I'll take them. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, hundred percent. So yeah. they've been in. These have been in for twenty minutes, and yeah. that's what they come out looking oh, like. Oh, that's good. See, they're good. They're crispy. They're, they're crispy. Yeah. They're cooked on the inside. Um, obviously, if you want to parboil them, you can, but the air, with the air fryer, you do not need it at all. Um, probably just chuck some of those in, to be fair. Um, 
and it just means if you come home from work, you can just um, quickly throw it all together. Um, the garlic butter, I cheat as well. We love so that. So I, uh, put, you can put some garlic puree or just put in garlic granules mm -hmm. or garlic, crushed garlic, yeah. into the microwave with some butter. And just into the what? Into the microwave. Not yeah. in the air fryer? Not the air fryer, mm -hmm. no, you need to use the microwave. So oh. you, you could, though, you could put them back in for, say, 30 seconds. With it on top. With that, oh. but like, I just put that into the microwave for one minute. Okay. Just drizzle So it. that, just drizzle it over. You have a bit of garlic butter. That's just, oh. Oh, the aroma of the garlic. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, and then that is, thanking you. I was wondering where my spoon went. I don't. Uh, so that is them, bit of Parmesan, and they are done. Right, um, lovely. And you can... They're just so nice look on the side. Look how nice and glossy they look. I know. Mm. That's so. Gar yeah, he's right, garlic butter. I love so. garlic bread. Mm. There we yeah. go. A dough bowl in some garlic butter. Yes. Oh. Last one then, here we have our pita chips. So if yeah, you have yeah, some steel pitas there is, there is. ready to go, that's them with a bit of guac on the side. Okay. So just cut them up with a pair of scissors or a knife into any shape. So if you have kids at home and they want like a quick snack, yeah. this is perfect. Um, all we have to do is coat them in a bit of paprika. And these will go into the air fryer for about ten, 10 minutes. Yeah, crunchy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just the guac you. as well, like, oh. is just loaded with chilli and... Yes. Who doesn't love guacamole? I could eat uh, guacamole. I love guacamole. Oh, that's, that's like my favourite snack, mm. guacamole. So, love when it. they are in 10 minutes, they'll come out just perfectly toasted. Bit of guac, I love, I could eat guac. Oh, a little, with a little crowd, please. You've got a few people over for dinner. While everyone's arriving, that's quite, that's quite nice. Totally. Yeah, that is yeah. beautiful. And that's, yeah. again, the things you can do with this air fry, and because it's not deep frying, it's not deep you're frying. using much less oil. Mm -hmm. Less oil, and it's better for your energy bill as well. So yeah, they're cheaper exactly. on your energy too. And also, too. washing up. Washing of course, up. yes, it's like one pot. It's yeah, like one literally yeah. like one pot wonder, Just take the griddle out, and give it a rinse, it. And, yep. and you're, you're done. done. Thank you very much. Thank you Thank so you. much. You. Thank you, right, for all the details on today's recipe and lots more ideas from our chefs. Download our free This Morning app.